devolution stakeholders are calling for enactment of laws for prompt payment of services rendered by businesses to, to the national and county governments uh, to address the accumulation of pending bills. Uh, Kenya Private Sector Alliance uh, CEO, that's Karo Karioki, uh, led stakeholders in urging senators to formulate new laws and scrutinize existing ones to uh, compel institutions to expeditiously uh, pay entities for services rendered and ultimately uh, end cash crime is affecting the devolved units. Gladys Mongai gives us details of the second last day of uh, Senator's induction in Naivasha. Consultations and, uh, you know, at least with parliamentary... The prompt payment amendment bill 2021 that received the nod of the Senate last year but flopped at the National Assembly could yet again find itself at the bicameral parliament after devolution stakeholders call for enactment of a law to impose fines on business owners, principal secretaries, and accounting officers at the counties for delaying payment to suppliers. And so we'll be looking at the Senate on the, to pass startup and small business laws that simplify trade and trade regimes for small businesses, and in turn, will encourage informal business in all the counties to formalize. It's not good for us to be saying 80% of our businesses are in the informal sector. We want them to formalize because then, then they can grow. On the final day of the Senate induction in Ivasha, stakeholders in the devolution sector claimed cash crunch experienced by businesses is one of the major reasons for the slow uptake of devolution. Our joint endeavor, which is the overall priority, which is just to keep strengthening devolution and to make devolution work uh, for the people of Kenya. It's need for us to structure on how we are going to look into the issue of pending bills, and I'm happy that already uh, there's material to start with as far as that, uh, that is concerned. We, in the fourth Senate, we are going to work very hard, and I hear the commitment from, from other senators to ensure that we will have laws in place that will protect the entrepreneurs so that they don't get auction and more so after they've done business with the government. We are where we are because of individual decisions by individual members of the executive. There are sufficient laws in this country to guarantee prompt payment to Kenyan business people and individuals or for works done and for services delivered. During the session, senators were also taken through the newly revised standing orders and emerging trends to enhance their legislative duty. Senator. This as the editor's guild challenged the Senate to deliberately put in measures and systems to ensure information is easily accessible by members of the public. As the 13th Parliament officially kicks off its business next week, the introduction and the passage of the Prompt Payment Amendment Bill will be key to ending the ever-growing nightmare of pending bills and necessitating the growth of devolution. For Channel 1 News from Naivasha, Nakuru County, I'm Gladys Mungai.